Deep Japan. My dream has come true. Today I'm here at Nikko Toshogu, the most amazing shrine in Japan. Let's go and see. Cut! Before I show you the one of the most beautiful shrines in Japan, I will talk a little about the mystery of Nikko Toshogu Shrine. The god of Nikko Toshogu is Tosho Daigongen, but it's a name as a god given to Tokugawa Ieyasu, who was the first shogun of Tokugawa family. Tokugawa family ruled Japan from 1603 to 1868. The mysteries are how the shogun Ieyasu became the god. Why is Nikko Toshogu Shrine located in Nikko, far from Edo, which is called Tokyo now? And why did Ieyasu want to be the god? There was an exciting scenario to be the god written by Yes. The first Tokugawa shogun passed away at the age of 73 in 1616, but two months before he died, he called Todo Takatora a senior vassal and Tenkai a Buddhist monk by his bedside and left a will about how to deal the death of Yes. It was like this. There are four points. Number one, bury me at Mount Kuno in Suruga, which is called Shizuoka Prefecture now. Number two, hold the funeral ceremony at Zōjōji Temple, which is now located at the foot of Tokyo Tower. Number three, keep the Buddhist memorial tablet at Daijushi Temple in Mikawa, which is called Aichi Prefecture now. A Daijushi Temple is a special temple for years. When he was young, he lost a battle, and he tried to commit seppuku, it's a suicide, at this temple. But a monk found it and said, you have to live and make the peaceful country. And he made it, actually. Tokugawa Shogun family uh, made the Edo period, which was peaceful for 260 years until the American warship came to Japan in 1853. Number four. At the first anniversary of Ieyasu's death, built the shrine in Nikko and moved the corpse to the shrine. This is Nikko Toshogu. I will show you later. In this wheel, there is a deep scenario in order to be the god. Look at this map. Uh, it is Edo, which is called Tokyo now. Ieyasu died in Edo Castle. Edo Castle is now used as the imperial palace of the emperor. Anyway, the funeral ceremony was held at Zōjōji Temple, and by his will, Ieyasu was buried at Mount Kuno. In those days, the capital of Japan was not Edo, but Kyoto, because the emperor lived in Kyoto. Actually, Mount Kuno is exactly due east from the imperial palace in Kyoto. And one year passed, the new shrine was built in Nikko, and his coffin was moved from Mount Kuno to Nikko. It is 300 kilometers away, and Nikko Toshogu is due north from Edo Castle. And furthermore, if you draw a line from Mount Kuno to Nikko, there is a Mount Fuji in between. Yes, Tokugawa Ieyasu tried to become the god using the holy powers. First, 
The emperor is a shaman. Even today, the present emperor Naruhito prays for the rice harvest or the happiness of Japanese people as his official tasks. That's why he wanted to be buried in the due east of the imperial palace. Secondly, Mount Fuji is the most sacred place in Japan, and Mount Fuji itself is regarded as a god. Thirdly, Nikko Toshogu is due north of Edo Kesso. Why? Because in those days, the polar star was thought to be the center of the universe because stars rotate around it. So if you visit Yomeimon Gate of Nikko Toshogu Shrine at night, you can see the polar star just above its roof. Tokuga Ieyasu needed the power of ruling Japan of the emperor and the sacred power of Mount Fuji. And he wanted to see Japan from the center of the universe after his death. For what? Remember, when he was young, he tried seppuku, but he was persuaded by a monk to stop it and to make a peaceful country. I think he wanted to become the god in order to protect Japan and to make it peaceful country after the death. Now, let's go and see Nikko Toshogu Shrine where the soul of Tokuga Ieyasu still prays for the peace and prosperity of Japan. This tori gate is made of rocks without any adhesive cement. Amazing. Five story pagoda, rebuilt in 1818. Everything in this shrine is detailed and colorful. At this entrance, I was warned not to draw my sword. These buildings are storages called Sanjinko. These elephants were made by Kano Tanyu, but he had never seen a real elephant. This is a horse table famous for monkey relief. The eight scenes express the life of a monkey. This mother is looking at the future of her baby. Famous see no evil, speak no evil, hear no evil. This means we should not show bad things to the young. It's like PG-13. Sitting monkey. If he stands up, it means independence. A monkey is looking up. It means he has a high hope. A monkey on left side is encouraging his friend. This monkey has to decide something, maybe marriage. This monkey has to overcome the raising waves. The last one. The monkey is pregnant and the baby will have the same hardships again from the beginning. This is a place to wash hands built in 1618. This is a gift from Holland. Oh my Buddha, 
The family crest of Tokugawa is upside down. You can see the famous Yomei Mon ahead. Its nickname is Higurashi Mon. It means it takes a day just to see it. There is a Japanese proverb about Nikko Toshoku. Nikko Mizushite Kekko to Yuna. Almost same as see Naples and die. Sealing Dragon. This is the backside of Yomemon. There are four white poles, and one pole is upside down intentionally because. The completed thing is destined to collapse. This one is upside down. This is a storage of Mikoshi, portable shrines for the festival. This white gate is called Karamon. I'll show you the famous sleeping cat created by Hidari Jingoro. Two sparrows are praying at the backside of the sleeping cat. It means the peaceful world, because basically cats chase sparrows. Finally, this is a way to the tomb of Tokugawa Yes. This area was closed to the public for 300 years. Now you can enter this area. This is a tomb of Ieyasu, maybe the center of the universe. How did you like Nikko Toshogu's shrine? I hope you like it. See you soon. Bye.